Violet first. Bill goes trick or treating. Introduction. Hello there. Welcome to another Violet first story. This is all about Bill going out trick or treating and ending up on the news. Main characters: Violet, Bill, William. Violet is a 52-year-old mother. William is Violet's 17-year-old son. Bill is a 58-year-old man. Bill is also William's father and Violet's husband. One quick thing: if I refer to something called the boys, I am referring to Bill and William. I am using this as a shorter term. That is all I have to say. Enjoy the story. Plot: It is a peaceful Halloween afternoon in Mount Airy, Maryland. In the Anderson household, all is peaceful. Violet and William are watching The Nightmare Before Christmas. Violet is devouring some popcorn, while William is eating some snacks. Fifteen minutes later a 37,924 pound Bill walks into the house, while grumbling to himself. Bill then asks Violet if he can go trick or treating. A few seconds later Bill is told he can't go out due to his age. Bill then processes this info. Five seconds later Bill roars at the top of his lungs. Two seconds later Bill starts screaming at the top of his lungs while scolding Violet because he wants candy. Ten seconds later William kicks his father's groin. Bill then screams while crashing onto the floor. William tells his mum to run upstairs. So Violet and William run upstairs as Bill starts to have a massive meltdown. A few seconds later Violet starts to barricade William's bedroom door, as William barricades his window. Ten seconds later a huge crash occurs. One minute later Violet hears Bill cackling like a sociopath. A few seconds later Violet hears her SUV grumble to life. Three minutes later the SUV is heard being driven away. A few minutes later Violet and William walk outside. Violet then looks inside, only to see her priceless glass figurine case is missing. William then shouts for his mum. Ten seconds later Violet screams at the top of her lungs when she sees her figurine cases drowning in their pool. Five seconds later Violet's SUV parks in front of the house. William then starts to chase his fat man child of a father. Five minutes later Violet walks into the house with a rusty hand saw. Ten minutes later Violet disposes of the bloody saw, while Bill is thriving in pain. An hour later Bill changes into his Donald Duck costume. Four minutes later Bill sneaks out of the house with a pillowcase for candy, a duffel bag filled with rusted tools, duffel bag filled with C4, and a duffel bag full of weaponry. A few minutes later Violet begins to panic when she can't find Bill. One second later William says that Bill's skull tracker is half a mile away. Violet then turns the news on. Violet then turns on to their local news channel. A few minutes later Violet and William begin to shiver with fear when they see Bill on the headlines. Fifteen minutes later the headline says Mount Airy citizen Bill Thomas Anderson is highly dangerous. Violet then sees a list of his crimes. A few seconds later William says suspect Bill wanted for for seven counts of armed robbery, 48 counts of arson, seven counts of aggravated assault, 28 counts of torture, two counts of attempted murder. 9 counts of first degree murder, 4 counts of manslaughter, 7 counts of killing unarmed civilians, blowing up 7 houses and killing 19 people. 39 counts of attempted terrorism, suspect is highly dangerous, shoot to kill if spotted. No legal repercussions for killing Bill, Violet then screams at over 200 decibels loud. 5 minutes later Bill walks into his house, with a bloody duffel bag. 3 seconds later I Bill sees his wife and son. 4 seconds later William closes some shades, as Violet closes the front door. 1 hour later, the FBI arrives at the Anderson household. Violet then opens the door, and says that Bill got a very painful beating that lasted one hour. Then several FBI officers see that Bill is almost dead, his body is falling apart, 70% of his skin is missing, some muscles are missing. Three of his limbs have been ripped off his body and are laying on the ground, several of Bill's organs are on the floor, and his skull has been shattered and his brain is showing. A few hours later Violet and William watch the FBI leave with an almost dead Bill. Then the two of them head to bed. Eventually Bill passes away after admitting to all of his crimes. The End